What if I told you that hidden beneath a thick, icy crust on Jupiter's moon Europa, there might be the makings of alien life? Sounds like something out of a sci-fi movie, right? But NASA's latest mission, the Europa Clipper, is aimed at finding out if this moon might just be home to some very surprising life forms. Orbiting the mighty Jupiter, the largest planet in our solar system, is an astonishing collection of 80 known moons. Each one holds its own mysteries, but none quite compared to the enigmatic icy world of Europa, a moon that continues to baffle and intrigue scientists with every new discovery. Europa's surface is a strange, captivating sight, marked by vast, crisscrossing cracks and discolored streaks that give it an alien beauty. But look closer, and you'll notice peculiar features that make it even more mysterious, features scientists have labeled, freckles. What are these odd spots? And what could be causing the chaotic fractures that carve across this frozen landscape? Throughout the years, six spacecraft have flown by Europa, capturing snapshots of its bizarre surface. Yet, much of what we know comes from one probe in particular, NASA's Galileo spacecraft. In 1995, Galileo arrived at Jupiter, spending nearly eight years circling the gas giant and performing close flybys of its major moons. But it was Europa that offered Galileo the most tantalizing clues, a puzzle that has only deepened with each piece of new data. This strange moon, while fractured and stained, holds another surprising characteristic. It's the smoothest solid object in the solar system. Unlike other moons with towering peaks and giant craters, Europa's surface is remarkably even, suggesting it's far younger than most other moons. Why? Scientists suspect something mysterious happening beneath its frozen crust, possibly a global ocean that is constantly resurfacing the ice. But how could such an ocean exist on a distant, frigid moon? Among the unusual formations on Europa are its freckles, or lenticuli, Latin for freckles. These peculiar spots, each about six miles wide, dot the icy surface and seem to hold clues to Europa's hidden workings. Many appear as smooth, dark spots, while others are jumbled pits or domes tinged with reddish-brown hues. Some scientists believe that these features are like frozen magma chambers, formed as warmer ice pushes up through Europa's icy crust, much like lava in a lava lamp. But unlike magma on Earth, these icy, volcanoes, erupt with freezing water from below. Recent studies hint that beneath Europa's crust, these strange features may sit atop vast, hidden lakes of liquid water. This outer shell of water ice, as solid as granite, is estimated to be around 15 miles thick, encasing what may be an even larger, saltwater ocean. The most intriguing question remains. What, if anything, could be lurking beneath that icy shell? Europa's most distinctive feature, however, is its dark, crisscrossing lines, called lineae. Scientists suspect these fractures are caused by Jupiter's immense gravitational pull, which stretches and squeezes Europa's ice in a never-ending cycle. This process, known as tidal flexing, could even be warming the moon's interior, creating enough heat to keep the hidden ocean liquid. Could these lines hold the secret to Europa's potential as a home for life? Further evidence of a hidden ocean comes from Galileo's flybys. The probe detected disruptions in Jupiter's magnetic field around Europa, suggesting the presence of a conductive layer, a likely sign of a salty, global ocean beneath the ice. And if that wasn't intriguing enough, astronomers using the Hubble Space Telescope spotted what may be water vapor plumes erupting from Europa's surface. Imagine if these are indeed water plumes. It would mean future missions could sample Europa's ocean without drilling through miles of ice. So, what are these mysterious freckles, these tantalizing clues scattered across Europa's surface? They hint at a world of water, where large pockets sit just below the surface and possibly above a global ocean that contains more water than Earth's seas. With this hidden ocean, Europa could be the best place to search for alien life beyond our planet. The tidal forces pulling on Europa's seafloor might even drive hydrothermal activity similar to Earth's undersea volcanoes an ideal setting for the chemistry of life as we know it.
Could something be thriving in the darkness beneath that ice? The mysteries of Europa won't stay hidden forever. In just a few years, we'll have two new missions exploring this icy moon up close. NASA's Europa Clipper will launch in October 2024, conducting dozens of close flybys that will bring us within 16 miles of Europa's surface. We'll have to wait until 2030 for it to arrive at Jupiter, but the data it collects could revolutionize our understanding of life beyond Earth. Meanwhile, the European Space Agency's JUICE mission, set to arrive in 2031, will study Jupiter and three of its largest moons, including Europa. And if all goes well, JUICE will even orbit Ganymede, marking the first time a spacecraft will orbit a moon other than our own. The early 2030s promised to be a thrilling era for space exploration, with brand new views of this mysterious world. Could we find evidence of a global salty ocean, teeming with life beneath Europa's icy crust? One thing is certain this enigmatic moon holds secrets that could forever alter our place in the cosmos. If you're as excited as we are to unravel the mysteries of Europa, hit that like button, subscribe for more space discoveries, and join us next time as we journey through the wonders of our universe. Thanks for watching.